Hi, my name is Jay Words. My pronouns is she, her. I'm here at SAE NYC with Beast by Girls for BBG TV. I'm gonna show y'all how I use the TX6 to make a beat. To start off, I'm gonna press this button on here on this knob and set up BPM. I'm gonna set it to 100. Then I'm going to press shift to go back to the main menu. Once I press shift, I'm going to press shift and this middle button here and go to where it says synth and press it. Then I'm going to go to the sequencer section. That's SEQ here. Once I'm there, I'm going to press shift again to go back to the main menu. Then press this little knob here in the middle and press play. A beat is going to play. By pressing these buttons here in the bottom, I'm able to mute. So I'm gonna start off with channel one. I'm gonna go press shift and this button here. I can go through the different menus by uh, holding down shift and clicking the different button, I mean the button for channel one. I'm gonna go to where it says sequencer and set a sequence. This is not your typical sequencer. Um, it has like pre-made sequence already. You just shift through the different ones and pick your favorite one. That sounds pretty cool. Once I have a sequence on channel one, I'm going to move on and do the same thing for channel two. I'm going to unmute this. Then press shift. Set the sequence for the snare. That sounds pretty cool. And leave that. Then I'm gonna mute uh, channel three. Hi hats. Gonna press shift and change the sequence for the hi hats. Pick something cool. That sounds pretty cool. Gonna unmute channel four. Press shift and four. Same thing, the set of sequence. That sounds pretty cool. I'm gonna unmute channel five and press shift here. I'm able to change the instrument for each channel. Right now it's in sine wave. They have triangle and square. I can also shape the sound by pressing shift and number five. Change the key of the song. Sounds pretty cool. I could also EQ the, the sound by using these little knobs here. I'm gonna move on to channel six. I'm gonna unmute it. I'm gonna press shift. And I'm gonna set this to the same key as channel five. Sounds pretty cool. I'm gonna change the instrument here. Then I'm gonna change the sequence. That sounds pretty cool. I'm gonna leave this beat like this. Once I'm done with the B, I'm just gonna press shift to go back to this main menu. As you see here, there's some effects. So I'm gonna press shift and effect. Comes with three different effects, reverb. Press shift and go to another effect, that's chorus and delay. To turn on the effect, I just press this button here. And it fix the B, you're able to control the delay. Go to a different effect, it's reverb. Same thing, you're able to control the reverb. And this is how chorus sounds. Has three different modes. I'm gonna go back to delay because I think delay sounds cool. And to turn on the effect, I just press this button 
and it turns on and off. Also, there's a filter here on the second button. There's also some other cool effects like this freeze. I'm able to freeze the beat. Okay, just press shift. It has a tape mode. Turn it on like this. Pretty cool. Has a filter. Turn it on. So when I'm on this view, I'm able to turn it on and off. Same thing as the effect. And then it has a crunch too. So you could get real crazy with this little mixer. And once I'm done making the B and I'm done jamming out, I could just go back to this button here and press pause. I'm Jay Words. Thanks for watching BBG TV.